Hey everybody, Prepper Nurse One here. So today, I've had the bees now about 10 days. Now I gotta show you a couple things here that I find interesting. Now I changed out the sugar water, and if you can see on this hive over on this side, their water's still pretty high. On this side, they're empty. Pretty much. All right. That's all that was left in that one. So the first thing we're going to do is change that out for them. But you can see they're way ahead, way ahead of the curve. So today's agenda, what we're going to be looking for, folks, we're going to be pulling all the things out of these hives uh, to check for queen cells. So I'm going to show you what we're, how we're going to do that. Start with this one first. See all the bees on the back side of that. Now, so I got my bee tool. So we're looking for queen cells. This here, if you see right here, that's the start of a queen cell. We don't want that on there. So we're going to take that. Let me get that right off. See, I'm going to pop that right one, that one off. This here as well, popping that off. And look on the other side, the other side looks pretty good. Now they're busy, obviously, which is what we want to see as well. From the activity in here, I'm going to say the queen is over in the center here somewhere. Now you can see they are quite active and this is only the second one in so we're just checking everything so I'm trying to be careful here at the same time because we're going to run into the queen Lots of activity, which is good. I'm not seeing any queen cells in here. 
So lots and lots of activity. Oh, maybe there's one over here. Let's see, what do we got? Nope, I don't see one. Well, look at all the bees, guys. So they've been going to town, doing their thing here. I'm telling you, we're gonna run into the queen, for sure, because Very busy, very active. Just show you that real quick. Look at all the bees. Very busy, very active. Not a bad thing. And again, I'm trying to be really careful here. with the queen. Sorry guys. Working on this one pretty good. Again, I'm not seeing any queen cells, so that's a good thing. You can see where they've been working here, guys, okay? Yeah, lots of work. Lots of work being done. Focusing more on the center right now, which is okay. And there's the last one. So So this hive here, I know we're going to see more activity. Actually, I'm going to do this for you real quick. I'm going to bring this over so you guys can see the center. So they're focused in through the center here, okay? It means that's where the queen's at. That is where the queen is at.
Now this hive here has been the much more active hive. I think we're going to see a big difference. Oh, that's not good. Um, I think we're going to see a big difference in activity in this hive here. I hope. <laughs> that's the uh, that's the hope anyway. So I'm going to show you the top of this hive, okay? Now we're going to check this one, and we're going to see what we can see. All right, a lot of activity, not seeing any queen cells, which is what we want to make sure that we're not seeing. Right. The queen's got to be in here somewhere because of the activity of these guys. very busy which is good I'm going to show you they're building out these boxes which is exactly what we want to see happen this is exactly what we want to see happening again I'm trying to be really really careful because I don't know 100% where the queen is at Obviously, we don't want to hurt or harm the queen. Okay, come on. There we go. Wow. This one's heavy. <laughs>
Lots of activity, which is good. Uh, these guys are real freaking active. Really active, which is a good thing. Right there, that little bit could have been the start of a queen cell, so we'll get rid of that one. Got activity. They're building out comb on these ones here, which is what we want to see as well. show you the comparisons look at the number of bees in this one now there's a tremendous amount there's a lot more bees in this hive okay So this is what obviously what we're looking at, okay? This hive here, much, much more active. That's why they're going through the sugar water that much faster. Uh, that jar was almost completely empty. And I'll show you that again. That's all that was left in that jar. That jar is not even close. So it's so bizarre. Well, each, you know, depends on the queen, obviously. But what we were looking for today, we were checking to see if there was going to be queen cells in these. There's not, which is a good thing. They're busy, which is another good thing. Uh, I will, you know, continue to give them sugar water. I will check again in uh, right around 10 days to see if any queen cells are developing. I realize now looking at where their activity and development is, I got a little bit of time. Obviously, it's very early in the development. We're only 10 days in, but they're do both hives are doing okay. This hive is actually doing much better work over here. But what we got to focus on, um, I got to get those other boxes painted and get them ready to go. All right, so long video. I'm going to go ahead and cut this off, and I will talk to you later. Prepper Nurse One, out for now.